Tom Brady, there he is. There he is, guys. There he is. What's up, guys, and welcome to Storage Legends. I know you guys waited. I know that you have to find out what that wheel is, and today, the moment has came. We're gonna find out what that wheel belongs to. Now, my guess, it's a, it's a moped. I know I got a couple of people that thought it was a Harley. Who knows, guys? But you tune into Storage Legends, and here we go. Okay. Okay. Now, in order to get to that wheel, we're going to have to focus solely on this. So, let's look. Okay, we have a box. I don't want to go through anything, guys, without showing you first. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay, these are like these are music boxes. Whoa! 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 You see it? You see it? Oh man, you see what I'm talking about? If I was just trying to move this stuff out the way, that would have not been able to be live found. I see a Bengals hat, guys. Without further ado, we got to, we got to check it out. We got to check it out. Oh, it feels like a big bag of them. Oh, look at this. Oh, this right here cleaned up and restored. I think that's a $50, $60 hat in my opinion. That is a very beautiful way of uh, depicting the Bengals. And guys, me and you and uh, LeBron James, we all know that the Bengals went to the Super Bowl, guys. Now, without further ado, let's see what else is in here. Oh, looks like a bunch of, looks like a bunch of, what are these, socks? Oh, these are like, like socks, like knitted socks. Look at that kind of sock. This this wouldn't fit me, but I would wash this and I would wear this sweater. Look at that. That's a really cool sock. I mean, that right there, just to like, you don't need to like wear any like slippers around the house. Your feet aren't directly on the, I swear, I'm gonna see if any of these fit me. These are cool, man. I mean, I'm gonna keep the camera rolling because at any time we can find something cool. It li we literally just witnessed it. So here we go, come on. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Here we go. So we got like a metal tray. This, even this is cool to me, dude. That, that is even cool to me. This is like a vintage metal TV tray from like the 60s or 70s. That's, that is so sick to me. Okay, all right. We got a crate. Okay, we're gonna kind of fall down. Stuff a lunch! We're good, we're good, guys. That was not a drill. That actually really just happened. Okay, here we go, we're gonna take out this. Whoa, look, dude, I can't make this. Dude, look at this. Right under, 75 cent Warlord comic. Can you believe that, guys? Let me come and step out here, see what's here. Okay, so we got, enter the lost world of the Warlord. 75 cent comic, that's a really cool find. DC, we got NBA basketball cards, Skybox, let's see what's in here, and this looks like little things that the, um, the belt buckles went in, so those are cool, looks like an old potato sack, there we go, there we go, Idaho potato. Right now, just catching up here, we're still working to see what's inside and what that metal wheel is. I wanna know, you wanna know, LeBron James wants to know. Here we go. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, whoa! Let's see it. 
There's something in there for sure. I'm just, I'm spoiling it, guys, right now. Three, two, one. Whoa. We see, let's see what we got here. Oh, nice. Penny sleeves, baseball cards. Let's see. Oh, let's take a look. Look at that. Wow. All oh, Penny Cecil. Look at that. Eric Davis. Man, Carlos Baguera. Um, Howard Johnson, Albert Bailey. Is a penny sleeve in the good ones, is what it looks like. Look at that. Alex Fernandez, Gary, Eric. I know those guys, guys. Series right here. Look at that. Jose Offerman, a couple of them. Mark Witten, Dave Winfield. I mean, like, what the heck? Okay. All right. That's not bad of a find, guys. That's why, that's honestly, that's honestly why I had the, the, the camera still rolling. Because, guys, you don't know what we're going to find, like, at any point. Okay. Let's see what this is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, snap. Dude. Tops baseball, the real one. Rack pack picture cards. What? Look at this. No way. It's a full box of 1988 cards from Tops. Crazy. We're probably gonna sell this whole box. I wonder how many boxes are in here. It's like one, two, three boxes in there. Three boxes in there. Insane. Crazy. Imagine if I was just moving this stuff out the way. You know what you would just missed? Like, this is insane, guys. Come on, we'll come back in. We'll come back in. Okay, okay. Okay, look at this. Whoa. Tons of hockey... Um, what are those called? Wax paper. Crazy right there. I mean, this is just, this is bonkers. We found Pokemon? Like, what? Okay, here. Uh, Pokemon, Pokemon last episode, guys. And now it's like, now we're finding just, just, I mean, dude, cards? Like, okay, here it is. Let's see what's in here. What is this? There we go. Look at this right here, dude. Close up on this. This is for all the babies worldwide that need pants. Baby pants. And then on the back, here it is. For all the, the mothers and fathers, hit me up. Because look at what it says in the back. They're laboratory tested. So I guess they're, they're laboratory testing uh, baby pants uh, back in the days, guys. So make sure, don't, don't get your pants that aren't lab tested. Get your pants that are lab tested, guys. Guapo Storage Legends. Whoa. Smoke bombs. No way. We gotta light one of these off. We gotta light one of these off. Get down! Get down! Save yourself! Save yourself! Go, guys, go! I'm glad we survived, guys. Honestly, at this point, I was gonna jump on the. I was gonna jump on the grenade. But I figured I would just pick up the live grenade, throw it, so that we get a chance to refilm something else later. Let's do it, guys. Come on. Okay. Oh. Looks like. I don't know what that is. It looks like a floaty or something. What? Look at this. 
somebody already bought one of these. Wow, look at that. New Kids on the Block uh, uh, buttons. And it's so cool because there's probably about like 40 on here. Like there's a lot on here. So that's actually a really good find. Um, just put like two, three bucks a piece. That'd be cool. Okay, here it is. All right. This is a portable toilet system. Check this out. Look at that. Right there, you push it. Do I do it? Yeah, I'm just gonna. All right. Whoa. No way. I got another box. Here we go. I don't think we're ever going to get to that, to that, to that bike. <laughs> Here we go, guys. One, two, three. Whoa. Look at that. It says all-time favorites. A children's treasury of the all-time favorites. That's so cool. Look at all these. I wonder what these are, because these are a bunch of gumball machines. You guys are gonna get a chance to buy these, actually. I'm getting a lot of them. Um, look at these, let's see. Okay. Oh, looks like a bunch of Ohio Cardinal, like, like, um, like a mini, um, like molds to put candles on. So sick, really nice piece. For Ohioans, this means a lot. Um, for anybody else that's not from Ohio, you're probably like, that's just a bird. But uh, we like uh, the cardinal. It's like a monumental like thing in Ohio. Just look at a little bit. I'm flipping this up. Tons more boxes, boxes. I see the bike. Oh my gosh, guys. Come in here, check it out. Whoa, look at this. that handlebars right there guys let's move it oh man here we go you got a good view you got a good view we're looking right here who oh 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 oh, oh! no way it's got a key Dude, it's got a key and everything, bro. What is that? It's a it's a Vespa uh Passio pa, pa I can't read. Guys, this is oh my god, there's another one! There's another one! No way! Oh Brave, it's made by Brave. Oh Guapo, what a brave soul you are. What a brave soul you are, Guapo. Whoa. Look at that. We got to pull this out, dude. We got to pull this out. I want to get a full view of this. All right, here. Pull this bike out, guys. I want to see what this bike looks like outside the garage. So give me about 10 minutes. I'm going to have to move the portable toilet. All right, guys. What I thought about was if I do pull this out, you guys are going to see my reaction for the other one. And I don't want to, like, miss that. So here we go. Let's see. We're going to move this aside. Conky's probably like, Conky's probably like, no! What about the super dump on the floor? Pick up the, pick up the super dump, Guapo! Pick it up! All right, here we go. Okay. This right here just fell off. We don't want this to fall off. We don't want to damage this at all while moving it. So the best option is to get everything off from under it. 
So we'll start with, oh man, we'll start with all the boxes. Oh, dude, dude. You see that? The second one, it says Concord. Guys, this is crazy. I'm going to move this right here. I'll take this back. Okay. Okay, I got it, guys. I got it. Okay. 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 All right, pause it and we'll get it out. Wow, we finally got it out. Man, take a good look at this bike. A 360 view, a close-up. Let's get all the images. Let's look at all the brands. Let's look at how cool this is because it has like a little, it's like, it's like a little like a, uh, like case to put your stuff while you're driving. Look at this, look. Wow, oh, maybe not, maybe not. This is probably uh, something that has to do with the engine or something. I don't know, this is really cool. Uh, I need, this is where the experts come in and start commenting right now, guys. The experts start coming in and commenting on what they know about this bike, what they can tell us about the bike, the value of it. Uh, Vespa, I don't know how to say that, man. Piaggio, um, and then that says what? Bravo, Bravo. And then look at how like, look at how like the the kickstand like elevates the whole bike. Um, the whole bike is completely elevated from that kickstand. And you got the you got the keys, then like where the um, where the gas goes. And then if we we go to the front here, we have the speedometer. And now this this thing is hitting 40. That's so crazy. You see, come from the other side, come from the other side. Let's see what that says. Borgatti? Borlotti? What's that say? Vigilia Borletti. Sheesh. And then look at this front little light right here. It's just making the whole bike look insane with that little beautiful light very nice bike guys i mean to say the least i think what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna go ahead and say oh, oh. guys you have tuned into the episode and we actually seen what the bike looks like what it what it, what the make is we found some really awesome other stuff um and right now we may or may not go and look at these sports cards and when we do i also want your reviews on these sports cards so we can look at all of them um and thanks for tuning into the episode guys make sure you like subscribe comment and i will talk to you next episode this has been an episode of storage legends love you guys all right ladies and gentlemen here we are what an insane box what an insane bike what an insane episode right we are going to end this episode with finishing off this box of cards, guys, so we can see the entirety of the awesome sports cards. Now, guys, remember, these aren't basic cards. They're signed cards. They're all over the place with signatures and sports teams and sports, um, you know, different, different types of sports. So let's, let's, without further ado, keep going with these awesome cards, guys. Now, I know a couple of you guys have reached out. A couple of you guys have purchased uh, a couple of these cards. Um, but yeah, guys, let's make sure that um, we look at them all. Here we go. We got Brian. Ooh, a couple Wayne Gretzky's. There we go. A couple Wayne Gretzky's. We got Andre Davis. Guys, we got Andre Davis. We have um, Troy Edwards. Tim Couch. Oh, tons of Tim Couches. Let's see, we have... Uh, Courtney Brown. Oh, I just dropped one. We got Dale Arnhart. We got, whoa. Oh, look at that. There goes Jordan. There goes Michael Jordan. It's a cool card. 2001. Wayne Gretzky. Ooh, shoot. Terry Cook. 
Tons of NASCAR. Wow. Kurt Kerner. Tom Brady. There he is. There he is, guys. There he is. Rookies. Wow. Look at that. Fleer Tom Brady rookie. Nice. Look that one up. Um, oh, drop that one. Jeff Reardon. That's a rookie card. Man, guys, this is a cool one. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Wow, 2000. I wonder what the heck. Sparky Anderson. Let's see who we got. Julius Irving. Ooh, that's nice. Julius Irving. Um, Brett Hall. Let's see here. Ken Griffey Jr. Daryl Dawkins. Tony Espato. Luke Robitaille. Let's see. Sherry Cheevers. Cam Nelly. Oh my gosh, there's tons of old hockeys, guys. Wow. Troy Edwards. Sheesh. Tons of them, guys. Look, in action, Guy LaFour. Bill Walton. Robert Parrish. Wow, there's a lot of good cards in here, guys. And like I, you know, like I said, I've done deals on cards already just to kind of get up in the game and, and leave a lot of meat on the bone. Um, it's possible. I, I definitely would, uh, you know, let go of these cards for significantly cheap because there's so many I have. Um, but, you know, for the most part, guys, there's certain cards in here that could be worth thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. And that's the exciting part is, is looking them up. You know, look at this Dwayne Wade. This looks like a rookie card right here. 2004 Dwayne Wade card. Rookie year. Another 2005. Let me see here. Dwayne Wade. Look at all these Dwayne Wade cards. This is crazy. Shaq. Dan Marino. Derek Anderson. More Dwayne Wades. Wow, look at all these Dwayne Wades. Dan Marino. Sheesh. Let's see. Dan Marino. Look at this, LeBron James, 2006. LeBron James, 2006. Wow. And guys, that right there, that is going to conclude all of those cards. We definitely had a good time this awesome episode. I want to thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching consistently and supporting the channel. It means the world to me. I want to propose and introduce an idea that was inspired by my friend Jeremy. Um, I want to do something for the UK, or the, not the UK, the Ukraine. I want to do something for the Ukraine. Uh, I'm not taking a political side or anything weird like that. I don't want to really get into politics. I just know I see a country and I see them going through a tragedy. I feel like I can do my part and try to influence you guys to do yours. Um, so stay tuned on updates uh, for that idea. I'm very serious. Excuse me. I cannot be any more serious about the situation. Um, so hopefully I can get some ideas from people and we can start doing some things uh, to help the Ukraine. Uh, other than that, guys, thank you very much for being here and I'll see you later.